as the hand warmer for grads is happening. We are very professional. All right, we're gonna transition that shit, and then while Leroy fin does the f works on the transition, I'm gonna look at the the screen and I'm gonna commentate this shit. All right, so this is Grand, Aaron versus Renzo. Aaron already won 3-0 against Renzo earlier in Winners Finals. I'm gonna be real. It looked very dominant for, or not, I mean, it, it looked comfortable. I should not say dominant, but it looked comfortable uh, from Aaron's side. Uh, game one was quite close, and then game two and three kind of just seemed to kind of get out of hand over time. Um, we'll see how it goes. Um, but Aaron quite comfortable going into this right now. He is gaming, taking the first stock. Renzo dedicating his tag to his fallen comrade that he killed himself. So that feels, you know, this is, I don't know if that's, that doesn't seem right, but um, yeah, it is going to be with the normal lead, but Renzo currently in the advantage position, but doesn't quite get the kill with the uppy, which is going to give Aaron this little opening. Doesn't quite convert as much as I think he wanted. It's a off stage. It's a little uppy. Ooh, just down smashes. Keeps him alive. A little bit of a closer one. Gets to grab ledge. Renzo needs to get a kill, but can't really manufacture one while Sheik just gets five. And just hit you with aerials. Take the second stock. Aaron, two stock lead. Nice little off tech. Keeping his stock alive once again. Aw, oh, gets the grab. Ooh, doesn't get caught by the little instant fair. Keeping this, this advantage going. And Aaron just getting so much value off of this one stock. Renzo just getting stuffed at every opening. Eventually, one weak F smash will uh, close it out. But think of the think of the the, the the things that he sacrificed for this. He lost two stocks for this. He might even lose another one. Let's see, we got some needles. A little bit too early. Ah, grabs ledge. And Aaron just up two stocks. Game one. I. I mean, Aaron is just in it. Aaron has not lost a step from Winners Finals. Renzo just kind of needing to find something. Maybe still in the uh, the the VS Fox mode. Who knows? But Aaron just in the driver's seat. Renzo trying to keep it together. Oh, oh ignore sorry. that. Ignore that. The man clicked on the transition button. Not intend to. Ignore. Ignore. All right. I'm thrown off stage. We're trying to get rid of this chic stock. I have to take care of two more. So he's on 69%. And it's gone. And he's getting combo. And he's been up aired. And he is dead. And Aaron. Two stock game one. Doing a very comfy. Right about now. Yeah. Alright, going for game two. FD. Renzo's counter pick. Let's see what he's got. I have said before that he is in fact an FD Marth. This is an FD Marth. He can cheek. Oh sure, a little fast. A little dash attack, a little down smash. It's a little value. Ooh, a little weird little turnaround jab. Somehow manages to get something out of it. Renzo needing to find a way to get off ledge. Successfully just kind of goes full in with the nair, makes it work, but now he's back at the ledge again. Gets through and just runs all the way through F smashes. Aaron beside himself, just thinking like, why, why did I just get hit by that? Why did that just happen to me? Somehow he actually recovers and takes the stock first, which feels almost rude to Renzo, just fully calling him out in such a rude manner. And actually, Aaron also getting some more damage off of for the stock. Once again, just stuffing a lot of Renzo's approaches. Renzo just not really able to get in, trying to recover, and Renzo not a bit tilted, not too happy about what's going on. Just able to um, get much going. It's quite rough, but he eventually does get that reverse up tilt going. Gets the stock. 
We are going. Let's see what Renzo's got. If he can go and equalize this stock situation. Alright, nice little re grab. Up tilt, up tilt, up air. Nice, keeps going. Ooh, gets a reversal. Alma gets a forward smash to get out of the situation. Ooh. And gets out of it. Gets out of it and gets back. Not out of it. Gets back thrown F smashed. What can you do? Just trying what he can. Counter not working out. Aaron just a step ahead. Again gets off the ledge though. Crouch cancel. Back on the ledge. Renzo gets back. Ledge dash. Oh, his tilt misses. Ooh, gets edge hogged. Last stock for game two. Aaron just menacingly on the ground. Kind of has the advantage and then just kind of Gets hit out of the advantage. Ooh, nice little edge hog from Renzo, kind of equalizing it. A lot, a lot can happen in his last stock. Ooh, but there's the opening for Aaron. Gets a lot of damage. Renzo, pairing, trying to kind of get away from this crowd cancel percentage. Just trying to clear away, away from the ledge, but it's fared off. There's back to ledge. Ah, er, oh, misses the ledge dash. Unfortunate. And Aaron is up two. Oh, in winner's side brands. He is one game away. One Yoshi story game potentially away from taking the whole tournament. Let's see what he's got. So again, a little bit of a scuffle. A little bit of a scuffle. We'll see what goes down. Oh, throw. Ooh, nice little. Ooh, Randall. Oh, he wants it. He wanted to cook. Didn't quite get it, though. I love the idea, but. See, so just slightly off. Didn't get the early kill from Randall. Just fight. Ooh, ooh, I like the little, little movement to get the fair. On the Aaron. Okay, Nair. Other way. Rinse and repeat. Ah, F smash misses. Ooh, roll in. Goes unpunished. He's off stage. Renzo, ooh, nice little movement. Doesn't even get an opening off of it, but just getting off, like just putting pressure on his shield like that, from being from a like on a, at a position on the ledge is so so smooth. Oh, kind of threatening by the ledge. Early up B sends Renzo to the other side of the stage. Ooh, the down tilt whiffs. Renzo gets center stage. Ooh, Aaron just dash attack straight through it. Fares him. Goes up on the first stock. This feels like this stock took forever for y a Yoshi story stock. All right, up B. Good tech from Aaron to keep the stock alive. Up tilt, that should kill. All right, we're back to even. Let's see if Lorenzo really can make it happen. Ooh, a little scary stuff. A lot of, little bit of a crouch cancel war. Oh, but Aaron gets away. Some scary aerials, but then gets a smash back where he came from. Ooh, get up attack. Weird little angle that sends at. Not as much as connect. Oops, missed tech chase. Ah, nice little edge lock from Renzo. And Renzo finally in the lead in this game three. Rungies has some life in him. What's he got? Oh, Randall making it slightly awkward. Ooh, some fast out of shield options. He runs off guard. Oh, roll from ledge. Aaron doesn't quite cover. He's not too happy about it. Ooh, a little bit of a missed little ledge dash or wave dash to the ledge for Renzo, but gets saved by the poof. All right, reverse Nair. He is back. What do we got? Little, little needles. And trying to get his way back into this game. There's a nice little mini combo going, but does get hit out of it. Ooh, nice little strength for Renzo. No kill just yet. Ooh, gets grabbed. The dash attack. Ooh, scary stuff. But still has, yeah, still had his jump. It's all good. No real problems here. Ooh, Aaron get double stuff by, by the two down tilts. Aaron stage again. Renzo with a great edge guard up to another great ledge hog. Last stock for Aaron game three. He transforms to Zelda because he's decided that he wants to back air Renzo to death, which I don't know what the vibe is there. 
But it has to be accidental. I guess? It's not Aaron style. I just don't know, wh I don't know what happened, but regardless, very weird. This has turned into a very weird game. Fares, friends off stage. Keeps, him, keeps himself alive. Ooh, normally winner though. From Aaron. Ooh. But Randall, nice little recognition on the Randall. Ooh, goes for the down smash though, and it whiffs. Oh, oh, jab, double up air or up B? All right, down smash, okay. Last stock for Renzo. Needs to watch out that I can come back to on. He needs to keep this alive. Gotta get the, gotta get the kill on the Sheik. Ooh, the rolls though. The rolls are so scary. Oh, the down smash, what? Oh my God, this is so scary. <laughs> okay, Aaron off stage. Up B. <gasps> F-tilt miss. Now that hits. Okay, kind of Ooh, really <laughs> weird Randall interactions. Okay, has to recover high. Oh my god, he's just alive. How is Aaron alive? Renzo has to get the skill. That's gonna be that. And that's gonna be game three going the way of Renzo. The first game that Renzo has taken off of Aaron today. Five games for Aaron, one game for Renzo. Gonna go to Dreamland. Gonna go to the Aaron counter pick. Let's see if Aaron can do something other than keep the momentum going and just win every game in a row. We're gonna have to come back from losing a quite a close game. A game that was lost in kind of a weird way with him kind of losing a lot of percent just to accidentally switching to Zelda. Let's see what he can do. Very early advantage once again, like just in control early on. And gets the grab again. Rinse and repeat goes on the state or goes on the side plats. It's down smash. Rinse again has to get from the ledge. Doesn't make it. That's a nice little double pummel. Nice damage on the side plat. Ooh, Aaron a bit greedy there, allowing Renzo a lot of extra damage. You oh, are right, a little, little edge cancel down there. Love to see it. Ooh, but the trade does not go Renzo's way. Yeah. Oh. Alright. Continuing uh, with a little lead. Gets a nice tech. Does keep a stock alive. Renzo again has to get these. Has to prevent these these long lasting Sheik stocks. Like. It's just, it's hard to kill Sheik, but it's just, it just makes your life so difficult if you can't get these Sheik kills. He basically has to get this edge guard. He's basically just a ledge hog. Gets a back air, fair enough, sure. So those equalize the stocks. But, man, like, Aaron's just getting, like, Sheik is just a lot, Sheik is just able to get these earlier kills, like, way more comfortably uh, than Marth is. Yeah, there's a strong bear. Ledge refreshes. Does actually recover on stage. Aaron does not quite convert just yet, but there it is. A stock lead for Aaron going into or within his counter pick. Got some more needles. Sequence though from Renzo here, getting some good damage. Not really in like the cleanest manner, they're all kind of just like individual hits, but damage is damage. And whatever you could do to just get this these chic stocks off of my fucking screen. It's positive. Aaron on the other hand, not really getting much off of that little opening with the F-tilt. Gets grabbed for it too. Ooh, rolls in, gets grabbed again. On the ledge, ooh, doesn't get his ledge side, just goes for the straight up the tournament winner. Gets a fair, gets his approach stuffed, but Renzo's the one that ends up at the, or uh, by ledge. Old ledge, needle, down tilt, fair, all right, all right, all right, all right, you can do that, you can do that. There, that's the last stock for game for Renzo. Here we go. We're gonna be in this one. Oh, this is a wave map. Bit of an awkward, yeah, a bit of an awkward interaction once again. Shield drop fair, but Renzo's the one who gets most of the damage from that little scuffle and Tipper F smash. Isn't a guaranteed kill. There's still, oh, still a chance to mess it up. Reverse upbeat. Also doesn't kill quite yet. Needs to do another rinse and repeat. 
but that's just a nair. That's not gonna kill. Oh, gets the fair. Oh, that was almost got a really like sneaky little uh, little call out on the pole, but didn't. Get on the ledge. This is such a high percent cheek stock. Recovers. Renzo needs to try and find something. It's a down tilt. Ooh, all right, that's gonna be that. All right, last stock for Aaron as well. Game four. Renzo definitely making a little bit, of a, a little bit of a comeback attempt. Let's see what he gets. Ooh, little Marth grab. That was a big range. Oh, but his his, his, his yeah his, his platform drop gets called out. Ooh, down tilt. Tech. Okay, still alive. Ooh, rolls from ledge. Ooh, Aaron's getting juggled. Renzo might be able to take this game. It's the fair Aaron off stage. Oh, oh but gets burned by the poof. Fair off stage. Needle. Renzo needs to get back on stage. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Oh, he just fares. Oh, and that's a needle. That's gonna be it. And Aaron is your Somnio 4 champion. 3 1 over Renzo. Great. <laughs> Showing from Aaron, feeling good. Look at him with his little hop. He's feeling good about it. Congratulations, great job. And that's that. This has been a very good tournament. Like I'm very, as one of the TOs and one of the commentators, I guess, this has been a great tournament. As much as the attendance has been, has been a bit lesser than the other editions, this has still been a very well, a very good event. I'm very happy with how it ran. Um, it was very, yeah, it was just a very well run event. The bracket went well. The sets were hype. I'm glad that people had a good time as usual. I'm happy. I'm very glad about this. But um, I guess we're just going to be doing like awards and such. But I'm not sure how big the chance is that. Yeah, I think it's going to be a... Uh, I'm not sure what the exact angle is going to be on this one. But yeah, I think I'm going to go. So thank you all for watching. Um, wait, what do we want to do with the slide? The DSA Winter Provo slide. Go to DSA Winter 2024, 10th edition. It's going to be Saturday, 6th of January 2024. It's going to be in Delft. Once again, 10th edition of the well-known Dutch regional national series out here. Um, it is a fucking vibe. I will be TOing it. Kim Banana Bar will be TOing it. Leroy is going to be streaming it as usual. It's going to be sick. You should go to it. I'm going to go to it. Please come. It's going to be the first big event of the new year in the Netherlands. Um, it's going to be the next big event for, like, you know, the PR period and shit. You know, who cares? It's going to be sick. Uh, it, there's probably not going to be an Aaron interview. I'm just going to leave the mic. And thanks for watching.